Thank you. Parking at VCU, hopefully a lot safer. The university unveiling a host of security upgrades at its parking decks, better lighting, hundreds of new security cameras, and a new high-tech system for parking permits. Madison McNamee on your side, and the safety team looking at the benefits of these changes. Maddie? Your license plate is your parking permit. Big changes for the thousands who use VCU parking garages. The old tag system is out. License plate readers are in. You know, these RFID hang tags, they were not cheap. Uh, people would lose them. You had to remember to move them from car to car. And while convenience is key, VCU's executive director of parking and transportation tells me this new step helps the university with its environmental goals too. Students every semester get a new one. Um, so you were probably printing 3,000 of them a semester alone on top of the, I don't know, tens of thousands of faculty staff ones that are out there. And it's tightening security. So we're going to have a much better idea of who's coming in and out of our facilities than we would have before. Um, because now you have to keep your, your vehicle information updated in our system. New LED lights have been added, more security cameras too, as there are now 600 scattered across parking decks on campus. Sometimes some weird stuff can go on in the parking garages, so it makes me feel better that there's eyes in there watching all the time. Freshmen Gabe McKnight and Charlie Toomey say it's making their college experience feel a bit safer. I think it overall makes me way more comfortable knowing that it's more specified to the car rather than you can just hand it to like your friend or somebody random that you don't know. Because it's the little things like a parking tag that can make all the difference. And there's a lot of hit and runs in the parking decks that we couldn't solve and couldn't help people and it kind of just you felt bad right like it, you park at your own risk anywhere but at the same time if we can help you let's try to do that. Now adjusting to this change could take time. Staff with VCU tell me they anticipate it could be a couple more months still before people are fully used to this new system, but they do remind drivers that you have to come to a complete stop with this change. You can't just keep cruising on through it. In Richmond's Madison McNamee 12 on your side. Thank you tonight. Louisa